New this morning, we are joined by Mike Nesbitt, an architectural designer working for the architect firm Morphosis. Mike is in town as the feature speaker for this month's AIA Omaha Lecture Series. Also joining us, Ross Miller, the event organizer. Thank you both for being here. Um, thank you so much for being here. Um, it's wonderful to be here in Omaha, um, especially in your, uh, in your new studio. And um, we're just, uh, yeah, really looking forward to uh, producing our, our flood show that opens up um, at the Standard Oil Building um, this, uh, this coming Friday, the, uh, the 18th. Yeah, you know, this is not only fascinating for you seeing the uh, 7 Burlington Station, but talk to us about the fact that you're not here just for the lecture. You're here to create some art yourself. Yes, um, it, working with, uh, with, with Ross here and the AIA, um, it's been fantastic um, engaging some of these uh, magnificent um, old buildings, um, especially the Standard Oil Building that was uh, originally owned by uh, the Mr. Mr. Rockefeller. And um, we're going to be doing something um, um, quite special and at a, at, a, at a pretty large scale and um, really engaging uh, the, local, the local community. That's awesome. And Ross, bringing him here, this artist, what are you hoping for the public to get out of this? And tell us more about this event. Yeah, I mean, really, you know, this is Mike's first show outside of LA. Um, and he came to Omaha, which is an amazing thing for this community. So, you know, I just really want the public to engage with the art, the design, the architecture, and just, there's just this really, uh, it, it's a great, it's going to be a great show. And it starts uh, Friday. Um, it's free to the public, 6, 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. Um, and then we also have the lecture on Thursday evening at Gallery 1516, um, also free to anybody to, to come and, and, and join us. And Mike, uh, before we let you go. What's been your favorite part about Omaha so far? I, I'd have to say um, we uh, going to, uh, to, to, to Market Street was absolutely wonderful. Um, we did get to catch a uh, Storm Chasers game um, yesterday. I mean, I did play baseball in a previous life. Okay. And um, no, it's been, uh, it's been wonderful. All right. Mike and Ross, thank you for joining us this morning. Oh. Great event coming up. Again, as always, we'll have this interview posted on KTV.com later for you to watch and to share. More First News and weather updates are straight ahead. Stay with us. You're watching KTV News Watch 7, First News Sunday.